So it's a cold, sunny day today, and Blitz and I are just getting in from our walk, and there's uh, something I thought about showing you that we haven't uh, shown before. So on the back of our Springtail Shop building, we have uh, the solar air thermal panel, which is made by a company called Solar Sheet. We had that installed about 10 years ago, and uh, basically what it is, is uh, up top you can see an electronic solar panel which uh, powers the fan and the uh, the solar panels themselves uh, essentially are just black metal with an airspace behind glass and this is on the southern wall of the building uh, which it heats up during the day and the solar powers the fan and then it just essentially pumps cool air from the shop and warms it up and pumps it back in as warm air. To be honest, I don't even know if Solar Sheet is in business anymore because uh, we spent probably about $4,000 on this about 10 years ago. And to be honest, I think this would be a very, uh, very easy DIY uh, project to do, particularly if you're building a building and you have a contractor already. So we'll take a look at the inside. This is the inside of the shop building. You won't hear the fan running because the sun has gone down now, but there is the upper vent that would blow out the warm air. And then down here is the, the lower vent, which the cool air would go into. And then over here is where the thermostat is. At its peak today, the temperature got to about 51 degrees here in the shop. And it's 26 degrees out with a windy feel of 13 degrees. Uh, the goal with the shop was when we built it uh, that we would, you know, we don't spend a lot of time down here. This is a prototyping and a inspection and packing shop. So we're down here about once a week, maybe for a few hours uh, in the wintertime. And when we come down, we'll preheat it with, uh, with these uh, big heaters up here which heat up pretty quickly but I didn't want the shop uh, really below uh, freezing at any given point so the that's where the solar the solar thermal heat came in and it's actually worked quite well I don't think the shop has ever dropped below freezing in the winter time you know and and the coldest this our winters get here is usually about negative 10 and on average I would say we have uh, somewhere around a 15 to 20 degree temperature throughout the whole winter with you know dips uh, sometimes below zero and mostly to zero at night uh, in January but if you have a similar project that you're thinking of uh, you know this this building you know with the dual panel out there this building is 30 by 40 feet so it's about 1200 square feet and those are you know those are the results that I get and it's pretty after the cost of the initial setup it, pretty much it's been uh, zero maintenance. We, in 10 years, we have only had to replace the thermostat, which was probably about 50 bucks. Otherwise, it's been completely free of maintenance. If you uh, like this video, please, please hit like. And if you have any questions about uh, this particular setup, uh, certainly put them in the comments and I'll do my best to answer. Have a great day.